Good morning, I'm Mrs. Reed and we're here at Jackson Davis Elementary School and this is my first grade class. And today we're gonna do a lesson in science on migration. We've been talking a lot about fall and we're also gonna work together to collaborate and um, problem solve together in groups. Good morning, boys and girls. Good morning, Mrs. Reed. Today we're gonna talk all about migration. Who remembers what migration means? Omar. Um, migrate. What does migrate mean? Fly, swim, walk. Good job. Fly, swim, and walk. What do all those things mean together? Cohen. My, no. They mean to move. Excellent. Are you ready to do our little chant? Yeah. Migration, migration means to move. Migration means fly, migration means swim, migration means walk. Excellent. So we've been talking all about how animals prepare in the fall to get ready for the cold, cold winter. What kind of animals migrate? Harper. Um, birds. Birds migrate. How do birds migrate? How do birds move? Joyce. Fly, fly by flying. So our favorite bird has a problem. We've been talking all about how birds can migrate and they migrate south for the winter. Why do birds fly south for the winter? Holly. So they don't get cold. So they don't get cold because they're going to a warmer place. But guess what? Today we're going to work together. We're going to collaborate and we're going to solve a problem. Who can tell me what our problem is? Who can read our problem nice and loud? Aubrey. Pigeon can't fly south for the winter. He can't fly south for the winter. So let's look at our question to see what we're going to be working on together as we collaborate in our groups. What does our question say? Ellie. How can you help Pigeon make it through the winter? We're going to work together. We've started our project by working with our partners, and we're going to try to, to help think of ideas that are going to help Pigeon get through the cold, cold winter because he can't migrate, and that's a problem. What is the word that we use when we talk about animals and they have to change what they're doing or how they're living so that they can survive in their environment? Drew? Adapt. They have to adapt. Excellent. So Pigeon is going to have to adapt in his cold environment. So we've started our projects together and today we're going to collaborate some more. Let's look over here at our six C's and let's look at our collaborator. All right, say it with me. I am, I am a, collaborator. a collaborator. I form, I form partnerships with others. Love it. Okay, so today we're going to collaborate with our teammates. And we know that we have certain roles in our group. I want you to raise your hand if you are a team captain at your group. Excellent. Team captains, you're in charge of making sure that everybody is on track and keeping everybody together and doing their job. Raise your hand if you are a voice level monitor. What, what is that job? What are you going to be doing, Teddy? I mean, you need to, um, like, if it's too loud, you can make a voice level on level one. What's a level one voice? What is a level one voice? Hmm. What's a level one voice, Kimberly? Um, a whisper. A whisper, yeah. So that we're not getting too loud for other groups. And our materials manager, raise your hand if you're a materials manager. Sammy, what is your job? Um, to get the things, to get the things that you need, the supplies that you Yes, all of our supplies are up here. So only materials managers can be up getting the supplies for their group. Now, I have one of our sheets, our planning sheets, that we've already started. Remember, we already brainstormed ideas together of how to help pigeons survive or adapt to the cold winter. Raise your hand if you can think of what your best idea was that you chose with your group. What was your idea? Navriti, what did your group choose? Oh, you're going to make pigeon a bed? Is it going to be nice and warm? Mm -hmm. For the winter. For the winter. Very good. Who had a different idea? What other groups had different ideas? 
Lily. House. A house. Excellent. Another idea that was a little different. Harper. A sweater. A sweater. Lots of good ways to adapt to the cold winter. All right, I want you to look up here. We listed our supplies down here, and our materials manager is going to help us get those supplies. Today, when you get to your group, you are going to look at the back, and you are going to make a sketch, a quick picture of what your idea is. So if you said you were going to build a house, I want you to do a picture of what your house might look like for your pigeon. So in a minute, you are going to walk to your spot for today with your group, and you are going to start your picture for your house or your bed or your sweater that you are making for pigeon to survive the winter. Yes, Ellie. Um, we have really good ideas, and we don't know if we can do all of them. Okay, maybe we can combine some of those ideas to together. We'll collaborate together, and I'll come talk to your group about that, okay? All right, I want you, if you're a team captain, to stand up and walk back to your table. Okay, boys and girls, we have two pigeons to use today, and they are going to help us build. So right now, I want you to flip your planning sheet over. And I want you to start collaborating or talking with your group about what you can draw for your idea. What are you guys going to draw for your picture? Okay, so what do you think? What materials did you say you were going to use? String. How are you going to use the string? Oh, that's what the sweater is going to be? Some of the other way, Kendall. To put inside his sweater? To keep him warm? Cohen, why don't you go up and see what kind of string and yarn that we have, and maybe you can talk to your group about how they can build the sweater. Harper, can you start drawing a picture of your project? Why don't we pick one of those? We have three ideas. Or we did Okay, a house with a bed. I love that idea. Can we start to sketch that idea out? And then our materials manager can start to get some of our materials. Can you get your pencil out, Drew? You're doing a good job. Keep the horse For the bed. But, and then we could put maybe a lid on the box so that it doesn't fall mm -hmm. inside wow. or what outside. Yeah, that you were going to build for a pigeon. But we need something sturdy a jacket and to make this. A cape. Sure, you can we show your group. Hey, because that would make it stick. Yeah, I also kind of love fall it. Down. How are you? How is Pigeon going to adapt to the if cold winter? He can't fall down. He, had a, he just looks so hard. Mm -hmm. Okay, if you guys are ready, your materials manager can go get some of the materials. Omar, talk to your team about what you're going to get. I don't know how to make a cereal box. Cardboard. What else did you guys say? You may start to get your materials if you have your sketch. What's your idea, Jen? Wow, that looks good, guys. Can you draw your picture first? Wow, that's excellent. I love it. Who's the materials manager? Now, Richie, can you tell me what some of the materials are for your group? I'm going to make that. They're on the floor. The boots are on the floor, and the jacket, it's clean. The boots are on the floor, it, and the gloves are okay. on. Do you have a good tape on? Okay, awesome. Now, Vritti is going to get some of the materials for you. I will take it off after. Look, I made them, I made them all up. Wow, amazing. So how are you going to build it? This is the sweater. I love it. Yeah, this is me. Okay. Do you want to test it out with Pigeon? Okay, test it out. Okay, let's start building. Okay, let's take this letter. Put your things on the side. Level one. What else is going to help him survive the cold winter? House. The house. What else inside his house could help him? Hold on one second. I'll be right with, I'll be right with you. There's no cereal in there, so what can we use with the box to help build Pigeon a warm house? We could. What could you put inside? 
some credit like cards yeah. through the walls. Yes. What, what materials go could we put? Omar, can we go get feathers for a pillow? Oh, I love that idea. Feathers would be a warm idea for pigeon. You guys can take, are you a materials manager? Yes. Okay. Uh, Do we need to cut that? Okay, take it to your spot number two and cut it and Ellie can have the rest, honey. Put all the feathers right there. No, that, now can I, can I have to take? No. Can I have that? Can I have to take? I'll give it to you, okay? Yeah, Okay. So... Did you get tape? You're going to need tape to tape it together, right? Survive. What other materials could you use? Talk to your group about it. Collaborate with your teammates. Can you go clean up the string? What did you guys build? What are you building, Teddy? Is this going to be his bed? What are we going to put inside it to help him adapt to the cold winter? Well, there's more materials, right? Sure, bring it back to your team. You need feathers? So you can get feathers. They're up there for you. Oh, I love it. What is this going to be for Pigeon? Sweatshirt. How are we going to put this together for Pigeon? Put these at the inside of him. We can glue it on Pigeon. Well, I don't know if we can put glue on Pigeon. Okay, now take that to that box. Yeah, I Oh, I would start taping them together so they can stick together. So maybe use some tape and help, Kendall. Are you collaborating with your teammate? Let's help put it together. We need to tape it on the side. Are you going to tape it onto the box? Is this sure? Do you want Pigeon to test it out? No, I think we need. Wait, what kind of? I need to go on the I like how Kendall is sharing her ideas with the team. Kendall, what was your idea? That would be a cool idea. Maybe we can like put the string on the box and then put the feathers on the box. That would keep him warm for the winter, just like we wear our winter coats. Are you putting a sweater and a coat on pigeon? Yeah. I like how you're working together to do that. Let's put it on every side. No, let's wrap the string around first. Are we making yeah, something yeah. for kitchen? Let's get started. Are we making a house? I need my How can we use this? Should we undo the cardboard to make it How about we can take this to the box? We can take this to the box. That would be more easier. Maybe you should cut it open. So that you can build walls around the kitchen, right? If this is his house. I mean to take this lever to the box. But I think we should do okay. this. I like that idea. Yes, Joyce. So they have to be able to slide on them because they can't just stick to it. Sorry, how are we going to use the boxes to help Pigeon adapt to the cold winter? Scissors? Here's some hair. What is Sammy working on? Let's see what she's working on. We want to make sure that we're talking to our teammates and collaborating. Sammy, what are you working on? On his jacket. Oh. Here's tape. Here, I'll put some right here for you so that it's ready to go. Is this a house for kitchen? Okay, what are we doing to help out? Let's use the West of the West. What else could we use? 
What other materials could we use? Wait, so you can use that low heat? Okay, what else could we use up here? Okay, maybe grab, let Loki grab one of those to, for his house. That would be a good idea. I like that idea a lot. Do you think that would be a good idea, Loki? Why don't you get a sheet of newspaper, sweetie? And he can have that in his house to keep him warm. Excellent. And put it over here. How are you going to keep him warm? Put it inside. Where's his house? Can we crink it? Oh, how is that going to keep him warm? Can maybe we do it like a blanket or crinkle it up? Would that be like a soft bed for him? How are you helping Pitch and Adapt? Ellie, what is your group working on? We're working on a house with multiple boxes. What are you going to put in the house to help Pigeon? We're going to put um, a bed and some food. Excellent. I love your ideas. Shari, what is your group working on? So we're working on a house while it's actually a little different. You're working on a house that's a little bit different? Is this the base of your house? He'll be too squished. Oh, I like how you're trying to solve a problem to make his house. Kendall and Harper and Cohen, what are you working on for Pigeon? A breathing hole for him? Do you need some help with that? Wait, wait, I know how to make a breathing hole. Just need a proper hole. Okay, we can help Cohen with that. Harper, what are you I mean, what are you working on? Amazing, I love that. Navriti, what's your group working on over here? This is the pillow tree, this is the blanket. Oh, Teddy, that looks like a warm bed for Pigeon, don't you think? Yeah. What else could you add to it to make it a little bit warmer? I'm talking to Teddy. That's a great idea, I love that idea. Drew, are you helping too? Pick up and let's put our tape away. Thank you, Ellie is doing a nice job. Joyce, I need you helping back here, please, with the glue stick. Those go up front. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed my lesson on migration. Go, Go dogs!